the brand new speakers that I use now. So that's their, their current flagship up there. Yeah, that was, it, from our perspective, on a design perspective, like everyone has such different ideas of what they want. And I love the idea of taking all those ingredients and making it into something that is one whole thing. So I feel like the, the project um, reflects a lot of what your core desires were um, and you know, just kind of getting into the space with the gear itself, it, it certainly takes some shape. One of the things that Howard also asked me about creating for him was really great lighting that could be adjusted, but you know, he wanted cool white to bright white. So we've chosen some fixtures that have adjustability from 2700 Kelvin to 5000. So if he's doing broadcast or photographing or, you know, he, he, he has his channel, this is gonna be both his great listening room, but it's in a way a broadcast room. Right, absolutely. And I didn't want any like, you know, garish colors. I didn't want red lighting. I didn't want green lighting. I didn't want lighting that changes from red to green. I just wanted some nice white, you know, lights that we can adjust to the Kelvin. Yeah, and also dimmable and, and, and something that could change the feeling. So we took the original design, we integrated into that, this lighting scheme that, you know, wraps around in a cove. So. All of this lighting also will be indirect, which is nice, so you're not having a fixture in your in your immediate face. Um, and, you know, I think uh, we also chose a, a light wood floor. It's actually gonna be a hard wood floor. Today, there's so many interesting flooring products. I, you know, uh, Jokavi also make an interesting piece, the, the cork-based uh, flooring system, which for some people is the only way they're gonna get isolation in their existing place. So you, it's got a cork layer with a with a with a, a base layer floor. Here we have a completely floating floor, but that has a huge impact, doesn't it? The way the floor responds. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Um, all all the furniture or all the elements are you know support on on, on the bottom on, on the floor. So it's very important to have a you know a floating floor to you know to support everything. So the cork it's a very interesting raw material, and when we make the all these products are made in Portugal. Portugal supplies seventy-five percent of uh, cork trees. That's why we use cork. It's a ninety-five, I think. It's a natural raw material. It's very interesting for me. And yeah, it's actually that's an interesting component that we we, we hadn't talked about, which was the environmental component of building a room today. And in the past, we always used fiberglass for absorption and materials that some have formaldehyde, they have glass particles that, despite anybody's thought about it, if you have a piece of fiberglass, even if it's semi-rigid and compressed, and you put a piece of fabric over it, those glass particles can actually still come out and can get in your throat, your nose, your sinuses. And so, in our studio design, we started moving away from all of that material into the natural materials that Joe Kavi have sourced, and they have like, they have a new 